All right, you know who's having a good time with the trailer? Probably the best time. Uh, not us. I mean, you know, we're we're just uh, we're regular about this. But uh, Eric July's arch enemy, uh, Dick and Vito, are having the best time over this. And welcome to the biggest problem in the universe. Let's do this thing. All right, what's your problem? My problem, Dick, is uh, one that we're going to need more context for. One of my favorite independent comic book creators has oh, okay. wet my whistle. With an exciting live action take yeah, was exciting. on right. one of our most beloved franchises. Trans heroes. Trans I don't know exactly, but definitely a bit of a mannish quality to her. What's mannish about a female bodybuilder that's Nordic and seven <laughs> feet tall? Hello, I am Yaira. <laughs> <laughs> All right. They're exactly Here's right. Yaira, you remember... Uh, Yaira, Yaira, the gym, the Sonya Blade knockoff, yeah. very feminine. I want people to pay attention to the 5 minute and 22 seconds. Now, I remember, Thank this you. is a trailer. What is this a trailer for? <laughs> <laughs> Who's the target Just of this? remember, this is a 5 minute and 22 second trailer. Mm. Think about other trailers you've seen and see if this may be. 90 seconds is the longest. Yeah, maybe, Red band, maybe. Yeah. Maybe a red band you get two minutes. Five minutes. Five wow. minutes, 22 seconds. Not a yeah, trailer. Right. I don't think we're going to have to watch the whole thing, though, because uh, it says trailer. It's very complicated. Yeah, it's, it's not. The it's trailer. It's the Yaira trailer. Rapiverse Studio. So he's Versace. ripped off the Marvel thing, too? Or they're... Everyone's ripped off the Marvel thing. You got you to show. Well, he's showing, his, did that. he's showing his animation behind that. <laughs> so very cool. Very cool. Reverse Studios is, of course, I believe a new imprint. Did he use that for his? Uh, maybe he used that for the animation. I don't know. And then there's a. Like what a the blood hell moon. is this? I really thought. Is there going to be some piss in your face? I thought after the accusations of Satanism, they would avoid having two crosses in front of a blood moon. I was like, ah, that seems like it's. Why would uh, I saw ministries have a problem with this? <laughs> I was like, this seems. I don't get it because they're fake Christians, right? Uh, That's why they don't like this. I get it's a gravestone, but. Kind of on the nose. No, it's just crossing. Shane, it's turn crosses. on your camera so I can watch you eat tacos. <laughs> in front of the, front He's of the not blood moon, which I would ordinarily like, but... Hold on again, a second. It's what is he doing? doing? Right. So, Shane, are you still here? Did he leave? Did he go to the bathroom? not doing anything. You know, we buy him tacos because we want to enjoy watching him enjoy the tacos. It is enjoyable to watch Shane enjoy tacos. He's worse uh, than the Sosa sisters. He's 50 times worse than the Sosa sisters. Yeah. Uh, all right, hold on. I'm, I'll go to 125 on this. I want to be able to hear him. Oh, it's cringe and dumb. Did you see the piss puppet on uh, Ethan's show? Did you, that was, did, that yeah. was pretty great. Is this a piss moon? Is it a piss moon? We want to watch doing great work, Is that's somebody what, pissing by one of these trees for. in someone else's mouth? <laughs> is there some twin pissing happening? Something going on. Anyway, it is a little clever. The twisted twins. I mean, but the T in the not cross twisted. is not. How a... is this clever? It should be two snakes wrapped around each other, hissing at each other. So it's also like a heart and it reminds you of an ass. Two T's? It's cute. I mean, this is bad. <laughs> it doesn't look great. I don't know why they got why that. Why is the sky blue? Yeah, well, it's being lit up by the blood moon of Twisted our Dark Twins Lord. Productions. Twisted Twins. How many, uh, how many title cards you got for a trailer? <laughs> We're 20 seconds into the... Don't normally it's have longer title than a normal cards trailer. trailer. Normally not a lot of title Shout cards. out to Vito in the chat. I was actually He's surprised. So I was like, well, they've <laughs> directed other stuff, so maybe this will be good. You know? I mean, guys, is this Floors Park? <laughs> this is Floors Park here. And it's not a uh, tax break in Vancouver, this Canada. It's going to be tough. Train my body to do things that. Wait, is this Eric? You didn't realize that? <laughs> 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 yeah, dude. What do you mean? Of course it is. <laughs> so, so the th so the thing that's not a self insert. Right. He's voicing the not he, a self insert yeah. character. He didn't he have begins... the black guy do his own voice. Eric had to do the guy. <laughs> yeah, and the guy, the black guy actually <laughs> had the right voice. And guy goes, "Listen, uh, yeah. I made the character, so I'm going to do." Yeah, because he's in the uh, you know the Behind the, the making scenes. of. Mm -hmm. yeah, Can you make imagine making a making of video of this and releasing? Look, I, I watched that making of video now, and what I what I've concluded is like the entire thing. It, it's just to kiss their asses. That's the entire thing. It's and like you like if you see like behind the scenes. If you watch ever watch like the behind the scenes thing, it's like here it is. It's raining this day. You know, we're telling you about some of the stuff that we got going on, some production issue or something like that. Ah, the. The delivery guy's late today. We're not going to get out of this not. until 3 p.m. You know, it's like you, you're into it a little bit. It's not about that. It's just to show everybody how great Eric July and the Soska 
sisters are. That's it. It's all about kissing their ass. It's a bunch of like people who you've never seen before who were just given bit parts and humiliated themselves in those bit parts, all talking about how Eric July, who has created some of the most generic and bland superheroes, who are supervillains, actually, uh, of all time, Tell him how great he is and how grateful they are for this role and how he is, uh, you know, uh, amazing. And that's what it is. And it's really embarrassing after this. Like, if yeah. it were something that was good, then maybe you would go into it and talk. It's a making of a piece of shit is, like, not not really the, the best thing in the world to show off. Um, <clears throat> and the other thing is, ordinarily with making of videos... You might have like, uh, hey, look at this. Neil Young stopped by the set. Neil Young's just like, look, I'm, I'm a fan of Eric July's comics. I, you know, I'm not involved in this at all, but I just want to tell you, Neil like, Young. I, yeah, that's the first name that came in my head. I don't <laughs> know why, kind of, kind of because he's a fucking leftist too, uh, yeah. you know. Um, and I'm really, uh, you know, this is just great to be here. Great to be here. Uh, and I, I, I know he's the future. You'll have different people come in. You'll just see stuff get done and, and stuff like that. That was this was just uh, people kissing Eric July's ass. And by the way, he paid to have people make a video of them kissing his ass. He paid for that and he produced mm -hmm. that. I got to do that too, John. I don't know why yeah. I haven't. First, I need people to kiss my ass though, and I can't find anybody to even say that I'm subhuman. Like I can't even find anybody who will even grant me my humanity. Film uh, a trailer. You know. Hmm. Oh, I need to film a trailer and then pay people to work in it. Whoever shows up is going to say, oh, working with Ethan, he's a genius. Uh, he yeah. looks great. Wait, did Snyder <laughs> give you a shout out? Yeah. <laughs> or James uh, Dunn? Who was it? Was it uh, Snyder gave you a shout out? Yeah, I mean, a couple of times, you know, to be fair. Uh, well, I mean, I have a, well, there's this. You know, he's told me exact. You know exactly what what happened with everything, and I'm grateful uh, for everything he's done for me. He's been just a completely stand up great guy from the beginning, from the moment it was announced I was doing this movie, and I really love him. I, I think he's a fantastic person. We all owe a huge debt of gratitude. You know, he really seemed to fit the bill in in like this perfect kind of confidence, lovable arrogance. Ability, you know, right. like real ability. Sorry. Thank you. Wow. Mm. Wow. That's pretty close. You know, that would be what I would expect from people. Like uh, only the biggest names in Hollywood. But you don't want, you wouldn't want uh, Snyder uh, praising you though. You wouldn't want him the way he does his own work. I mean, you wouldn't want his praise. At least James Gunn does some good stuff, you know? Yeah. Well, I mean, I, listen, as far as I'm concerned, everybody should praise me. I don't, you know, I don't expect people to reach my, you know, my level, I just, uh, my threshold, uh, just admit that I'm great and, uh, say thank you to me. And that's what they've done in that video. So, uh, uh Matt Grendel says, I want to thank you, Ethan. Thank you very much. $5 for thank mm. yous. Appreciate that. Uh, all right, let's get back to Dick and Vito here, uh, who are having a great time at Eric July's expense. Voice. Oh, do you do voice acting? No, no, no I don't. I can't really. even talk really. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah. Is this the right? Yeah. Yeah. See, it's, 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 it's like that. The whole you, thing is like this? No, just this part of the trailer oh. is a fake cell phone camera, and you've completely fucked it up by getting Oh, that's dumb. It. All right, hold yes. on. All right. Sorry, Somebody geez. on the street has seen uh, I saw him. I don't know how they captured it in slow motion, though. That doesn't make sense. Well, um, <coughs> the slow motion setting on the iPhone is difficult to get to. So if, yeah. you're, if you're filming something, you'd go, oh, shit. I got to get a... I got to get this. Oh, sh oh, shit. Okay, let me get in slow motion. <laughs> okay, now I'm in slow motion. Yeah. All right. It's a... Uh... Okay. And it's very so steady, is too, isn't it? His not yeah. Not yeah. yeah, somebody just sat there. And some the very first line cell phone. <laughs> okay. Just like me shouldn't be able to do. But unfortunately for me, blind Vito. ain't one of them. I told my body to do Don't things, but I didn't teach it to fly. Can you pause right there? 
So did you hear that line, don't follow me? Yeah. Okay. All, yeah, that scene is when he hits Gyra in midair, and then she throws him down. Right. So It's like we're reliving that same scene in every <laughs> I single scene. I was about Eric for several years. It's like Chris Chan just making Sonichu over and over and over. It hasn't been one it's year really, yet. Um, bizarre. Well, here's what's really bizarre is, um, so you're making a trailer. But it is like a like middle schooler, you're right. Like, who don't know, who didn't read Isom, to be like, here's what's going on. <laughs> so instead of off screen, a woman's voice goes, don't follow me, which is extremely fucking confusing to anyone who has not read Isom. Mm -hmm. Why don't you cut to her in her the face. sky? Yeah. Flying, storytelling, and then not really, just oh. green screen it. Oh yeah, okay. And then you would go floating there. Oh, yeah. And maybe she could have her arm in like a way that it's clear that she threw him. You know, yeah. that it's not just a black guy falls from the sky onto a car for no reason, right? And a white lady off screen says, "Don't follow me." Was he trying to rape her? What was he? <laughs> why was he following a, a white lady around? <laughs> I want to know. She's white. Well, from the voice, it sounds like okay. some sort of white. Yeah. A black man was following a white lady. I don't know. An why. archaeologist. What we feel is going That's to Lincoln Eusebio. Undeniable asset here at Projectus. So I think. Hair. I don't know why they made him look way different. Why does everybody have crazy like a hair? Boy here. I thought he, he looks really to be young. Yeah, he's supposed to be like calling Abraham big, Lincoln, like according to you. Imposing guy. He beat up Darren. Darren. This guy couldn't beat up Darren. Darren. I look like a little. I look bigger than this guy. I don't know if that's Lincoln, but I thought that was supposed to be Lincoln. He said his name's Lincoln. Projectus is his company. How much? You know how much I hate that I know all the Isom lore. You know. It's like actually infuriating. It's not at you. It's the same thing. <laughs> I am. Oh, what's the what's the what's the live action trailer gonna be about? The same scene. <laughs> okay. It is weird that he just wants to film the same scenes that he's already made. We heard to our team, Doctor Sally Rodell. Why is he so smug? Doctor Sally Rodell. Adopt or die. That's the first thing you say when you get up to the pulpit, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. We've just hired uh, Sally Rodell, and I get up there and go, adopt or die. And then this guy's screaming, ah, adopt or die. Uh, I would scream more uh, if I said that, like this guy is. Hold on a second. $50 from Andrew Sabina. Oh. There's a function on uh, Grand Theft Audio, uh, Auto 5 that lets you capture game footage. I tried being creative with it once and made some dog shit videos. I'm utterly ashamed of. Uh, I'll put them up against this trailer any day of the week. Uh, I don't, you mm. know, Andrew, there will be no competition. Yeah. Um, mm. Yeah, all right. I mean, they go. thought this was good when they released it. They were so proud of this. 100%. Yeah. And there were people in the chat. See, this is why I'm doing this, guys. There were people in the chat when this, when they, uh, Eric premiered this going, ha, ah, EVS is going to cry when he sees this. Ah, Dick <laughs> and Vito are going to be so <laughs> sad and mad. This is the best thing that happened to me all week. Uh, this is so fun. It is so funny. And you think, like, Dick and Vito are getting just as much of a kick about this as uh, I am. Here's one thing that is going to constantly be true and be proven to be true over and over and over again. These guys are incompetent. You yeah. can continue to give them your money uh, all you want to, and they will spend it. Eric July and his friends will spend it making more absolute trash over and over and over again. And it don't hurt me. Shane, does it hurt you? Uh, it hurts my brain if I have to watch it. I'm a, I'm a millionaire. I'm okay. Uh, I'm just here to uh, laugh and have fun. And to warn, to send out a clarion cry. This is my real. Like, I mean, that makes me sound like a small and petty individual. I don't want to be portrayed as that at all. Let me, let me back up a little bit. Mostly what I'm here to do is just say, oh, my God, it's happening again. It's happening again. You know, here it is, guys. Uh, you allow... First of all, you've got like uh, an incompetent, weird, uh, lulbatarian who thinks he can make comics and he can't. And then he hires, he immediately goes and he hires some SJW radical feminists who he puts in the highest positions of power in his company. Uh, they love bomb him and then immediately begin to destroy all his shit. It's happening again. And of course, I'm going to chronicle it with John Malin because uh, yep. this is this is our wheelhouse. This guy's strange. Why is he? Oh, why is he? Why does he look like this? Where did they find this guy? Adopt or die? Adopt or die, that classic phrase we How all know. How come they use this, uh, like, a, is she like Eva Perone? What was up with that angle? Of her giving the speech? Yeah. The press conference you like that on. If yeah. you're like a dictator, if you're like Hitler, it's like, you're, that's a down, you know, looking up shot. Well, I think they want her to be imposing. Oh, you're right about that. Is that guy blind? Oh, now, pause real quick. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Wait a minute, we're pausing too much. Hold on. I don't care. We need to do that. Dr. Sally Rodell. Dr. Sally Rodell. So she was sitting in a chair next to the stage. 
Like Shooter McGavin. Shooter McGavin, yeah. <laughs> hey. Women <laughs> in high Chevy heels. Spent more t- if they spent any more time in the sand trap, we call him David Hasselhoff, right? <laughs> <laughs> if Lincoln Eusebio spent any more time in the sand trap, call him David Hasselhoff. Adopt or die. Adopt or die. Tell off, Pork and Rod. <laughs> All right, can you pause there? <laughs> Clearly Alvacore. Clearly areas until Alvacore can arrive. And then a lady runs by. Now, did you get what she was yelling? No, what'd she say? She There's says, a shoe sale at, Mar- at Marv's. Solari, save us. <laughs> referring to <laughs> This whole thing is just uh, Solari? references. That's what his name is? That's the big uh, the Nazi probably, looking, su- the Nazi probably looking Superman. Superman. Yeah. Solari? Now, they the, call him Solari? They call him Solari. Solari. But here's what's confusing. <laughs> yeah, it is Italian. What's confusing is like, okay, Superman, I get like it. Solar Man? Solari? So, That's Brian his name? Solari, yeah, like the sun. Sol. S O L. Okay. Of the sun. All right. Okay, Wait, but let me hear that again. Secure the area till off pork and rod. Solari! <laughs> <laughs> and that's one of the Saskas. So, oh, no. No. Doesn't... no! Solari! Save us! <laughs> Save who from what? Well, that's, that's what the, I'm... What... The guy falling on the car? Right. Well, that, we also don't know what's... Yeah, that's true. We don't really know what's happening right now. We know something is happening. One, People two. are running away but from the cop isn't that worried. Never I mean, really find out what happened. Exploding, and you go, no. oh, I understand what the problem is. Is that cheap to make? Uh, you, could, uh, you, could you could just put that in, right? I mean, I don't know. Honestly, I mean, look, you can, you can. Yeah, there's a lot of effects out there. Save us! <laughs> well, it's confusing to me because, like, the Alpha Core in the comics is like kind of a new thing. But according to that, and also people like don't trust them. But also, apparently, white women, if they're scared, run around and scream the name of one of their members specifically. If there's black guys falling out of the sky, yeah. white women are gonna be very scared. Let me tell you that. Why wouldn't you just keep <laughs> running? <laughs> Why would you? <laughs> really, black men? <laughs> oh God, the lava save us! <laughs> Why would she turn? What is she looking at? Like, like you would just keep running. Even if you're calling out for the Solari, camera. yeah, she's looking. It's mugging for the camera. <laughs> if you're running away, you don't randomly turn and go Solari. I have seen a lot of Lifetime movies. This is really weird. This reads like a Lifetime movie. It is. A, um, okay, let me see that again. Very. Or die. Okay, she's not an actor. I know that she's a bodybuilder. Uh, you can tell. Um, well, you know they all have to start somewhere, right? Well, uh, Hercules in New York was not this bad. They, were, they went ahead and overdubbed his lines. Oh, yeah, so that's bad, true. actually, that's true. which they should have done here. Hmm. Uh, I don't know why they didn't overdub this. That would have made sense. <laughs> Here's Blind M- McGee. Well, is he so Daredevil? They, they, the they blocked the scene. So they blocked the scene to say, <laughs> old guy runs past. Why is he wearing blind people's shades? Hey, why is he wearing glasses? Yeah, why you should see the panic in his eyes. This yeah. is your first connection to a scene of chaos and pandemonium. You should, you should wide, look into his fucking eyes. eyes. Instead, it looks like a blind guy. <laughs> Yeah. Did anyone see my dog? <laughs> <laughs> His name's Solari. So like the Ethan. superhero? I know. Yeah, Real quick. We're going to say a guy running past the yes. camera. That- uh, the guy on the right is like looking off to the right and up. But isn't yeah. all the action over on the left? Isn't that where the threat is, where that girl is at? Isn't she on camera left? I think so. Yeah, we don't know what. I don't think. See, this is one of the. the John, nothing about this holds together. Uh, th- mm. I want you to just understand, like, this isn't a matter of opinion. Like, the Saska sisters are incredibly incompetent storytellers and filmmakers. Like, if you're not putting... If there isn't a bathtub scene with a naked woman in a funnel in her mouth while another woman vomits into the funnel, they don't know what the fuck they're... they're they don't know how to tell stories. Somehow, um, the idea of making vomit pornography, putting it on VHS tapes, uh, you know, has convinced Eric that they have enough clout to actually make superhero, low-budget superhero mm-hmm. films. They do not know how. They are ridiculous. This is silly. And no, they, they don't define, like, what the problem... How hard would it be to go, uh, there's a problem here, and this is what the problem is. I'm sorry, but, the, you know, the last square block of, like, uh, mm-hmm. you know, uh, this town is, like, on fire right now, and... Uh, this giant monster's coming towards us. Everybody hold the line. You don't have to even show it. Just talk about what's happening somewhere. They don't do that. People are running in different directions. We don't know what the girl's problem is who's on the ground. We don't know what Yaira's involvement is, why she's there. None of it makes sense. And why? Why is Isom in the beginning? Somebody right. made a, another cut of this where they had Isom just do all of the dialogue, do an overdub for this. And do it like much quicker in 30 seconds oh. so when i saw says uh you know i'd love to find hold on let me see if i can find that but yeah it, it makes so much more sense as storytellers uh the incompetence here is just um it's amazing it's well, absolutely even with amazing. A low budget they could have some sound effects imply like a lot of damage right. is happening in the city i mean you could just have noise with police like, sirens 
You, you can even have yeah, like a, a fog machine vibrant, putting right? in some smoke, like something is half burning off camera. Well, um, yeah. There's many ways to make it better, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. And I understand the low budget thing, but the, you know, um, Eric's cope about how I didn't spend much money on this and I just did it in a day. So what? You know what I mean? Seriously, so what? Like, w there are ways to do this for, uh, with like a shoestring budget, as he says, and in a day that would have still told the story. Uh, yeah, the properly. foundation is bad. It, it, everything else is bad because of the foundation of storytelling is bad. Right. Yeah. Let me see here. Suit Yourself is the guy who uh, did that trailer. Thank you, Sheila. I appreciate that. Because I couldn't remember if it was uh, him or Discovery. Discovery's making mm -hmm. some great things lately as well. Um, suit Yourself. How am I supposed to find this, Sheila? Hold on. Um, double pleasure is waiting for me. Double pleasure with Satan is gone. Who's that one guy that recut all the uh, comics? Maybe he could recut this trailer too. The uh, he's working for, for me now, and he's yeah. yeah, he's very busy. There's no way I would let him uh, stop doing what he's doing. Uh, all right, here we go. Oh wait, this is on YouTube. I'd rather show it on YouTube. I think. Welcome to Texas. My name's Isom, and I'm one of the few superhumans around here. They call us Excepts, short for exceptional. But I gotta tell you, some days, I don't feel that fucking exceptional. Hmm. Learned a lot in just Adapt 15 seconds. Or die. That's Yaira. She ain't even from this planet. And she's the one that threw my black ass across the sky, falling <laughs> onto that parked car. Secure the area till off cook and ride. And shit's about to go down. And it won't be me saving this shithole of a city. Goosebumps. That's yeah, just ten times better right there. The symbol is yelling a lot shorter on top of that. Oh, that's it. <laughs> yeah, that's all it needs to be. There we go. Woo! Yeah, Yara! Better Woo! pray. I'm on your side. How do you like that? What did she say? Hold on. Better pray. I'm on your side. Better pray I'm on your oh, side. Oh, that's kind of badass, yeah. Fucking Better awesome. No, no one knows. No one knows whose side she's on. Hmm. Yeah. See, uh, there's a story there, and the thing is, if you open up with Isom's inner dialogue, uh, yeah. inner inner monologue, he needs to narrate the whole thing. And since we already know kind of who Isom is, uh, you know, from uh, his comics, we're kind of excited to hear him sort of say, "It's not going to be me who's going to save the shithole city." That's something that he would say because he quit. Right. Uh, and then you don't have to say it's going to be Yara. Just show that logo, and it's like fuck. One, one more time. Welcome to Texas. My name's Isom, and I'm one of the few superhumans around here. They call us Excepts, short for exceptional. But I gotta tell you, some days, I don't feel that fucking exceptional. Adapt or die. That's Yaira. She ain't even from this planet. Made it her last and she's the one that threw my black ass across the sky falling onto that parked car. Secure the area till off cook and ride. Shit's about to go down. And it won't be me saving this shithole of a city. Yaura. How much would that have cost to make? Better pray. I'm on your side. The accent is better. I don't know yeah. what kind of accent would that Brit? Is she a Brit now? I don't know. More British. Yeah. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. Uh, ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous that it couldn't be that good. And I mean, it's just, let's get back to this now. 
that makes sense. But why is she running in the opposite direction? We don't know what they're running from. And then a guy in a rent and army, like, it's just kind of, he's just kind of wearing a green shirt and has like a kid's a walkie guy who's talkie. never used to walkie talkie before yeah. in his life. He's trying to look like an army guy. He's running. That one? He's running towards the chaos, and now a lady's gonna run away from the chaos. Why are they roping off the area? They're fl they're flying around. What is the roping off gonna do? If the area's already closed off, shouldn't these people have already been running? They've been. Did you set up the barrier and then they got scared and they ran away? Adopt. Adopt or die. Or die. All right. Secure the area till Alpha Corps can arrive. Till Alpha Corps can arrive? That's like Eric's weird affect. Just talking. say secure the area. Call Alpha Corps. We've got a situation. So, That's it. Not are they until not gonna secure Alpha the area. Are they going to stop when Alpha Corps can arrive? Say, secure the area. Somebody call Alpha Corps. Alpha Corps on the way. Alpha Corps on the way. Some, no, but secure he, the area. Call Alpha Corps. He can't know arrive. That. He's got to say, call Alpha Corps. We have a situation. That's the line. But it's Solari! Alpha <laughs> Solari! <laughs> Why did, does she already know? Does that random lady Why know? Why does that lady know Alpha Corps on a first name basis? Are they that popular? Solari. We can establish that. They all call him by his last name yeah. to annoy him. I guess. Call me, you can call me uh, Super Brian. Why does she oh, know? Solari. There's other Super, why is she not calling out for P.I. Savage or whatever? Why is there like, <laughs> why does she have to investigate? <laughs> How does she know specifically which hero to call for? Why does she call for Isom? I don't know. This Who lady, this lady was in a crisis. She saw something horrible. Solari! And her first instinct was, Solari! Has he saved her before? <laughs> is he known for, what? Uh, this is, is he like, like Jesus? That means Jesus saved me. <laughs> Solari! I'm very hung up on that woman. I could talk about it endlessly. I guess I should just let it go. Please stop replaying this. Die. Here comes that guy. Ah! Stop <laughs> tossing it. We're never going to do That's a meme, dude. Somebody uh, needs to cut this. that guy and like, cut uh, him out okay, the and have him uh, screaming across the oh, screen. Oh, wow. After. Okay, okay. Pole siding with you on this Solari! one. Solari! Till Alpha can ride. Till Alpha. Okay. Solari! It is the truest law of the earth. Very few things have the ability Wait, to she's Scottish? the test of time. She's supposed to be Icelandic. She Though has ice power. Guys, please hit that thumbs up in the chat. With the struggle of fruition, will be the trend of echoes. We're trying to beat Flashcast. We're yeah, ahead no, by 200 no, people, I think. Let's get a lady from Iceland Ooh. to do her voice. Uh, Iceland is like, ooh, Swedish chef. Oh, the birdie, the birdie, the birdie. I have no oh, idea. Oh, I thought she was supposed to be Russian when I heard this. Yeah, let me hear that again. Sounds like Zangief. Yeah. Though we may not be all around to see them to their fullest fruition. Though we may not be all around to see them to their fullest. Oh, these lines they're giving her are bad, man. Fullest fruition. You don't have to say fullest. You can just say fruition. Fruition. Yeah. Though we may not follow them to their fruition, we will make Mother Projectus very powerful. Look at this shiny ass. Uh... <laughs> that also doesn't make sense for a tech company to have what looks like a comic book are logo. They a tech company? They're supposed to be like a tech. <laughs> it's supposed to be like Apple. Can you imagine what? Apple being like projected? It looks like a fucking like a. I thought they were a biotech company. Maybe they're biotech. Yeah, she's like so an like, archaeologist. She's an archaeologist slash biologist. They're a, yeah, they're biologists. Really How do you know that? The oh, they're gonna say it. Oh, okay. I just mean look at the shininess of it. Yeah, the shooting. Well, somebody Usually, pointed can out. Can you see a camera? Don't get in a the reflection. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make a gloss sign if you're filming. But I'm gonna say, you know what? Technically, in press conferences, do they usually light from the back like this for the? Backlighting? I don't know. Is that normal? I don't think you. Do, I, don't I don't think you usually give a tech. I like the at like. Night. Um, somebody was pointing out the microphones. Like a boring hotel. Yeah. Lobby. Yeah. They're like uh, podcasting uh, mics. Right. I mean, <laughs> great. One of them has an arm. Oh yeah. 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 From? I don't know. Parts unknown. I mean, this is supposed Can't to be like Apple keynote speech. Keep hitting that thumbs up. Thank you, everybody. This is a whatever office building. They got enough microphones. They got enough. How many microphones? Why that many microphones? Pretend a black celebrity raped a white woman. Gotcha. <laughs> and then she threw him into a car. But we struggle to curse now. Struggle? Would we struggle? <laughs> Would we struggle? Would we struggle to curse now? Would we struggle? Would we struggle? Shane, how's that taco bell? Well, I don't think they've ever given her official uh, country. Unmute yourself. But she has Shane. ice powers. You're muted, Shane. So therefore, in Eric's brain, he goes, where would you get I'm ice from? I'm taking a taco Probably break. Iceland. I'm letting it I settle. Like I ate three. <laughs> I, I ate three. I ate three. 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 Honda. She had a little gym outfit. Three. Yeah, she's Seven massive. more. I think she's supposed to be Nordic. Thor. She's. I think. You know what? Let's go. Okay. Thor. I'm going to tell you this right now. She's definitely a descendant of Vikings. I think mm -hmm. that seems pretty obvious. Oh. She's supposed to be like really old. Okay. It'll be the triumphant echoes from the past. Outcore, be there five minutes. Hold the line. Five minutes. <laughs> Thanks for the heads up. <laughs> <laughs> Who was he saying Thanks, that to? Are there like supposed to be other cops there who are like, oh, thank God they'll be here in five minutes? Wouldn't he be shouting that at the crowd on the other side of the? Wouldn't Why he have he a normal man-sized microphone and not a Fisher Price My First uh, megaphone? Why is he shouting at, at where the roped-off area is? Right, he should be telling the crowd. It this way. Everyone, get back! Alpha Core is on the way. <laughs> they will be here in five minutes. This is stuff that good directors think about. 
Like, it doesn't make sense that he shouted. Who is he talking, shouted talking to? Uh, by the way, this is why wokeness ruined movies and video games Shane's because eating. the Sasuke sisters are intersectional feminists. Yeah. Um, they're very woke, and they're obviously incompetent. Uh, this could have been produced by any number of people in L.A., men, who are extremely competent at uh, mm. all of these things. Um, for less than whatever they spent on this, Eric July probably wouldn't want to have a weird piss threesome with them. Uh, but it could have been done. But yeah. when you hire woke people, they are s- stupid and incompetent because all they care about is their dumb woke agenda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, just throwing that out there. FYI for everyone. Your joker hire Maybe too. some consultants. <laughs> right yeah, him. You can have well, a man there to tell him. Here's how the army works because clearly you don't care about anything military related because you're a woman. Here's how cops work because you don't care about that as well. He's, he's panning around like, oh, wait, like wait, he's wait, aiming wait, at multiple wait. people. Who is he talking to? <laughs> that guy is just walking by casually. He's not even like, like, okay, if you have a guy on a Going megaphone and he's got to command the fact that this is a serious Put situation. Put smoke in right? there, man, you dumb bitches. This Put a fucking fog machine in there to make it look like there's destruction happening. I said this. Right? I said this. Why is this guy just calmly <laughs> walk? In five minutes, the alpha girl will be here. Okay. Cool. <laughs> it's just a guy walking past. Nobody cares. I like the guy with the luggage, though. To get, Mention that. Are they waiting for? Are they changing clothes? Also, <laughs> Solari what jacking. are these people running from? You haven't established the threat in any way. Show something oh, blowing up. That big cock uh, in Jackass 4. That's what they're running from. I can't believe the stage direction was, as this guy with a megaphone <laughs> yells, panic! There's panic! Oh my god, wait for Alpha Court! I want you to calmly walk you can get some people across in the, the screen. Like 20 people, 20, 30 people? There's I remember first goal post getting like, owned this, again. Cry harder. no one there. I saw, like, I saw two people post. running in different directions. Like, this was going to be the worst thing that ever happened in the city. What is, and what now there's just people off? behind a police line being like, oh, what's going they on over here? They framed the shot so that they, you can see where the prop tape is over yeah. here going over here. But this is not roped off. That's not roped Usually off. Go around. It's like, you know, roping off an area. I don't right? like so you can't accidentally I don't wander understand. in. Like, like, this is the kind of thing. Incompetence. Where, anyone on set could go, hey, can we just use a little more police tape? And also, everybody act really spooked because you're all just kind of walking around and it's not. Only one guy is giving it his all and it's a guy with a toy microphone, which already looks silly and childish. So everybody else, like, Help that guy. I feel bad laughing because this poor, this poor girl, this friend of theirs, also a woke activist. They bring in their friends. She's already, actors. hold on. She's already in front of the tape. Is she gonna be behind the tape in the next shot? I don't know. Five no, she won't. <laughs> Thanks for the heads up. Thanks for the heads up. Oh, thanks for the heads up. And then pushes the guy for no reason, even though there's like no one That's there assault. that she needs That's to get assault. past. An off- Ralph went to prison for that. Yeah. Or jail. Or I don't know which one. Ralph went to jail for eight months for what she just did. Got in her way. And she That's pushed it. her for no Got reason. In her way. That's woke shit, man. Sasuke sisters are going. Hey, you got to put her like girl bossing this up, man. Put her shoving the cop in. I'm looking at me stumbling. He's like, Whoa! this guy's just <laughs> trying to keep everybody safe until Alpha Corps. Is this where she flies? I was here. I lived. I am still here. I'm on you. Wait, what? Okay, what was so that? What was I, that last time? I was hold here. On, I on, lived. Is she like a Holocaust survivor too? Yeah. A rape survivor or something? I lived. I am still here. Among you. Among you. Among you. What was that cut? Uh, weird audio crossfading. I was here. Vi was there. I lived. Vi lived. I am still here. Among you. Whoa, weird audio <laughs> clip there. <laughs> Among editing. you. Yeah, yeah. there's like a clear what? blip on the thing. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so this is okay, what so this is the problem. Here's what doesn't All make right, any let's... sense. Every, was everyone running from this lady who's on the ground for no reason? And yeah, why she's she on the DI consultant. At... She's sweet. She runs this is sweet baby CEO. Okay. Did they <laughs> accidentally delete one of the memory cards with half the footage on it? Why do you say that? Because why was everyone running away from a lady in a jean jacket who's already on the ground? That's what I was asking. To the ground? None oh, yeah. of it makes any sense. So I have to read the comic to find out who knocked her to the ground? <laughs> Horrendous. Um, white racism. Okay. And everyone was running white away from this. Nick Fuentes knocked her to the this ground. This made a man so scary that he ran towards her, and a lady so scared that she ran away from her, <laughs> screaming for Solari. <laughs> Solari! <laughs> and this is the threat. This is, this is what we've been building is towards. Is she a mass shooter? Does she have like an AK? Uh, she, well, I was there? expecting like a big alien monster blowing up the like. Oh yeah, my god, yeah, that's too expensive though. Well, All right, let's let's see, let's okay. see. Maybe this is what everybody cool. was freaking out about. <laughs> she looks like I a lady know, that killed. Why is she not like shooting lasers? Well, what do you mean? She, she should be shooting about. lasers or something. Well, let's see. Let's okay. see. Okay, she's on the ground already, for some reason. Um, yeah. Now she shoot a bunch of goo into space. Well, the Sasuke sisters mouth? are big on vomit, so why not <laughs> super vomit? Yeah, super laser vomit. She can vomit lasers. <laughs> laser That's vomit. kind of the trademark of their work. It's like you know how uh, what's his name always has the doves. The Sasuke sisters. John Woo. John Woo. Yeah. Okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. So she walks in, shoves the cop, and the lady throws up space vomit. Throws a laser for no reason I can possibly understand. Wow. Think about space vomit. This thing can look like it's coming from her throat. It looks like it's coming from her jaw. The uh, the special look. effects are lacking. See, it's like off. Yeah. Ah! Can't wait for Solari to get here. Where did that go? Did it? 
Oh, she's shooting off okay. like Iron Man. So, <laughs> again. Wait, where? Where's that girl? She's right here. Here's my theory as to why they're missing footage. So she's flying. Where is she going, Dick? She's I mean, take, like she's 20 feet away. Air I want to go reason. to this so place. So she's going somewhere. Where is she going? In yeah, British Columbia. Going? 10 feet away. Well, let's see. Okay. John, do you want to reenact this movie with me? Because no, you can see her like <laughs> float, start floating. Watch. Just right. refill it. She's flying. Watch. Yeah. Floating. Right. See, she peeks at her flying. Okay. And then stares at this little girl. The lady, and this girl has a Christian uh, cross neck necklace for some reason. Uh oh, because she's a bad guy. Because Sasuke's sister. Well, is I, th I think Gyra might be the bad guy, but I don't know. <laughs> I mean, if you're throwing the up. Alpha Core doesn't like her. I know that. So the thrilling, the thrilling flight, flight, the most exciting superhero power. And okay, now she's on the ground again. So she, she did a short hop to yeah, get yeah, to where yeah, the lady I know. was. That's dumb. Mm. What did she say there? <laughs> Something about children. Sweet children. Oh, child? Child. Chilled. Sweet dreams chilled. Sweet dreams chilled. Sweet dreams chilled? Well, that's her way of saying child. Are you sure? Is it an ice pun? Like, I mean, Mr. Freeze. It would be cute if it was an ice pun, but I don't it's think not she a makes pun. puns. Sweet dreams chilled. Like, put it on ice. That's an ice pun. Put it on ice. Chill out. That's an ice pun. Sweet, dream, sweet dreams chilled. That's not an ice pun. Freeze. Get out of the way of my ice laser. That's not an ice pond. No, it's not. I don't have any uh, of Okay. <laughs> Put it on ice. So she punched the lady. Is that but she punched us. Yeah. Well, it's POV of us getting punched. Joy. But we're at her eye level. Yeah. Well, she's about to punch us. Yeah, but we're, look, we're laying down. There's a lady lying on the ground for some reason, and Yaira needs okay. to jump towards her and punch okay, her. Okay, look. On the ground, right? right? Why is she on the ground? No, 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 no. Just okay. listen. Sure. You're on the ground, all right? Mm -hmm. Then Yaira lands. Talks to you, but where is this? You're this is not an on the ground shot. Punch downward. We should have. This is not on the ground. Right. What you're looking at. You want? Mm. Well, the camera tells us cute. That's the kind of thinking that made this. A little shake. It's cute. Yeah. Well, then you have to put it on the ground looking up. All right. You can't do like you're standing up. I'm gonna give him a little bit of credit. Because of the zine. Because you guys zine. magazine. Well, now we're in the same uh, creative right. space. Is that struggle? Is that struggle? It's affliction of creation. I would like to thank Mr. Eusebio. For allowing me it is like an Eusebio. Okay. He looks like Alongside a little bitch. I thought he was going to be a big old guy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, like an And now he's wearing a stupid cowboy hat because that's his thing. He's in Texas. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, pause. Hey, go back a second. He's from Texas. No, it doesn't work both ways. arrow key back. Uh, go, why? Why'd you want to pause? Because I want to show his stupid... What? What it's tech? Elon Musk. Even a tech... Okay, but Elon Musk... I remember Musk. that when Elon Musk got made fun of wearing a cowboy hat, they decided to put that in the... Was he also trailer. wearing a t-shirt and a big Texas belt buckle? Like, yeah. that's the... And everyone made fun of it because it looked so stupid. <laughs> the Saskas... Eric said, that's awesome. Put that in the... This is not the kind of guy who should be wearing a t-shirt around. He looks like a That's what you wanted to say? This? Yeah. All right. Look at him. Um, usually when someone's foreign and they say stuff like thank you and yes, they use their foreign tongue. Mm. They don't say thank you. They say like donka, donka or whatever donka. it is. Uh, that's like a little character thing. All right. It still I'm kills me they don't have more audience. Okay, yeah. Wow. It, 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 yeah. I question her credentials. Be my they had more staff working. Why couldn't the Such staff, like the, the crew, yeah. be the audience? Right. Well, Dr. Rodell, from my understanding... He's an unusual woman. Don't be threatened, Jerry. She's on our side. Black woke woman. Is that some sister? That is. A trailer? Wait, that's uh... what is exciting about this? That it's in the trailer. <laughs> you get to see all your favorite characters: Lincoln, Savio. She's doing old uh, white robot man. shit. Don't be threatened. <laughs> uh, whatever. I some sister is named Altona Ria. Altona's here. And Yaira, <laughs> she's got a blue suit. Get it? Because Yaira yeah. wears blue. Yeah, yeah. She looks kind of mentally handicapped Dude, this here. Is so oh, long. Yeah, right, because her eyes are blue. I got it. They're clapping. You can cut at any time. At any point, you can cut. <laughs> <laughs> you got to get that hat tilt in there. You got to get that hat tilt in there. It's like the the, the Family Guy Star Wars. Da -dun, da -dun, da -dun, da -dun. Yeah, everybody uh, preparing. Oh. Okay, she's still on the ground. Trying to knock me out? Oh, go back. Well, That's a classic line. You took that like a chomp. Took that like a chomp. Took that like a chomp. <laughs> Ew. Gross. You took that like a chomp. Were you trying to knock me out? No. If it's meant to be a dip, well. Oh, my God. And then another instance of ADR to dialogue where I go. It wasn't five minutes. Why not just cut to Solari so that we know who showed up? They didn't have the money for that. Now the audience has to assume you could like you could have his. You don't even have to show him. Just have his silhouette, yeah, a guy in a cape, just completely down. silhouetted out. You yeah, see his cape yeah. flying. 
Uh, there's a lot of inside baseball. Show a giant. John Malin, you know, watching this a trailer again, are there things that you would have done differently as a storyteller, or are you pretty much like on board with uh, most of what you saw? <laughs> like, do you have any uh, other ideas? Yeah, for how make you a could story. I mean, make a story. Step one. But uh, again, a trailer to me, a trailer is a, a series of different scenes that more or less kind of progress through the film and say, here's a highlight. Here's something mm -hmm. of interest. Here's something more. That's a trailer. This is a TV pitch without a story. This is mm -hmm. just showing, this is to show an executive in Hollywood, look, this is going to work as a television show. And these guys are basically your actors. You can replace any of them, but look, we found a Yara. So mm -hmm. you should be pretty comfortable that we can actually cast this character. Uh, what do you think, Bosch? Do you think that this could be a TV show? No. Now, also, one thing I will say, though, considering how bad Hollywood is, who knows? At the same time, they might be like, hey, we can make, make something from here. Some, who, who knows? But at the same time, I think that was their wish. I think that's what they were expecting. And when they got, you know, I'm, I'm assuming some of the fans pretend to like it, but at this point, they know it's not good. That's why I think Eric made a video you know, trying to cover up for it and say, hey, look, man, we just made this thing. We just threw it out there. You know, I didn't spend any money on it type thing. We were just playing. Um, yeah, we were just playing. We, 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 you know, no, you don't put as whatever money they put in was too much. I don't care yeah. how much. It was. Wait, so you're saying he went out there and said, this is how good we are when we don't even try? That's more or less. What right. Yeah. You know, the, Eric July is basically like um, one of these guys who sits there and watches baseball. And he sits there and he goes, it's going to be a no hitter. It's going to be a no hitter. Like I'm Matt's, pretty sure that's you. <laughs> uh, he's, gonna, he's like one of those guys. And then like, um, you know, it's like, well, you know what? I'm better than you. Uh, I could, uh, you know, you're a bum. You're, it's going to be a no hitter. And then somebody goes, oh, do you want to audition to be on the Mets? And I go, yes, I could be way better than the Mets. Mm -hmm. And I get a tryout audition and they give me a bat. And they, they, they throw like a uh, hundred pitches at me and I can't hit one of them. And in fact, I shit my pants. I fall down, uh, you know, basically uh, everything, the worst possible performance. And then I get up when everybody's laughing at me and I go, that was just the audition. When you put me in the game, right. it's going to be a different story. I wasn't serious. Uh, I wasn't serious. Yeah, that mm. was just, I wasn't, you know, when you put me in the game, obviously I'm going to act and behave accordingly. Right. Uh, and that's uh, essentially uh, what what we just saw, what we just witnessed there. I mean, this is embarrassing, honestly, to release this and pretend that it's good and to actually believe it enough to send it out there proudly. I think he was like hyping it up, wasn't he? When he released yeah. it. Yeah. I mean, that's just, the guy has no, no, no standards. I mean, that's really what it comes down to. He has no standards. He thought, and, and again, for him to judge as harshly as he does Marvel and DC, again, it has to be, it has to be better. It just has to, you can't talk that big a game for years, which is what he's been doing for years, and come out with shit. Well, I mean, I'm I'm okay with his special effects not being better than Marvel or DC or CBC shows, but that, there was very I mean, but just basic storytelling, yeah. like I mean, sound effects. You know, I, I don't think anyone's complaining about the special effects too much. Even the blue light thing, it's 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 used yeah. in all movies, but it's the point about there's not is no cohesion. It's like mm -mm. okay, I don't get it. What is this? I guess it's a female superhero. That's about it. You know. Yeah. Well, I mean, that's a sad thing. I mean, Eric Eric has no talent. That's right, Jose M. Uh, and it's a hard thing to realize, like, about yourself. You know, well, it's like, um, I thought I could do have, it, but I can't. He doesn't have to have talent, though. Like, he's hiring his Oscar sisters. He's hiring well, they uh, don't have any talent. writers. He just has to have an eye for talent at this point. He fashions himself as being this publisher, this businessman. He needs an eye for talent and hire people with talent to get stuff done. Uh, Riververse Gold, uh, Coat Post is here. He says, oh, come on. This isn't Marvel Studios. Unfair criticism. I'm going to let uh, Bosch handle a response to this allegation. I'm just saying, it's like, look, when you send it out there, it has to be as good as you can make it. I don't care how much money you spend. It has to be enough where people say, you know what? That was a good effort. That's just not the case. It was not a good effort. From from the bottom down, meaning from the, con from the conception uh, stage. There was nothing that, you know, says, wow, that'll look really cool in a visual form with actors. No, there's nothing in it. If you just take that, what they did as in script form, I mean, think about that. How bad, how much worse it would be even like you can't make any, anything visual from that, but they did. And so, you know, again, we're not even 
it's not even a point about saying it's not Marvel, but but when you talk a big game, when you have Ripperverse Studios, it, it wasn't just Ripper, you know, it was R- Ripperverse Studios, right? And they put their and they put their logo. They're trying to say something. They're trying to say they're telegraphing to Hollywood and others. Hey, we can maybe go in your field. Maybe you want maybe you want what, what we have. And again, there's nothing there. As John says, it's, it's true. At the core, there's nothing there enough for even these studios, at least ones who make sense to themselves, say, I, I think they have something there. I just right. don't see it. I just don't. Uh, and CW, here's some more criticism. The trailer is terrible, but you are obsessing way too much over it. And I want you to just, I, I'm going to draw attention to the last word in this sentence, it. That's not, the trailer is just a symptom of hubris. And that's what I'm obsessing over. It's not the trailer. It's the trailer is just one more piece of shit uh, that is the result of this incredible hubris. Uh, And the fact that like uh, people are funding this hubris, you are literally flushing your money down the toilet. Uh, You will continue to give him money and he will continue to give you inept product that embarrasses you, embarrasses himself, embarrasses everybody who participated in it. And I don't mean to be mean, but like, really, it's, it's, you know, almost disgraceful. Uh, mm. And it will be seen historically uh, as one of the most embarrassing moments in comic book history. And that, John, that includes uh, the hiring of Mags Visaggio, even wow. more embarrassing than that. Wow. Yeah. Holy moly. So uh, that's, that's what we're obsessing over here. That's what I'm obsessing over uh, is the hubris and the failure, which is really fun. I mean, it's very entertaining to watch and comment on. It is. Uh, and, you know, people like it. That's and, why and this guy's watching. The guy who, who's criticizing you, he's watching this. Yeah, he's a he's big in- fan, and you're you're in the audience, of course. You know, we've got 2,500 people almost, four shy of 2,500 people watching right now. Uh, and um, there's a reason for that. People are fascinated by, by a catastrophe, uh, which is what this is. And people, some people don't quite realize how big of a catastrophe it is yet. Uh, they're still going, oh, but he raised, you know, another million dollars. Yeah, I know. And that million dollars is going to go to make more shit for us to make fun of. It'll, you can fund this until, you know, until the cows come home. It's never going to be good. And there's a reason for that. And the reason is a lack of talent. Right, Shane, or wrong? Well, no, it's a lack of talent. But I feel like it's going to come around eventually when there's, like, tons of video of people wearing like this product and and it's like hey this never panned out as you're talking shit about disney as you're talking shit about dune 2 or whatever i mean it's going to be weird later on i think i think this will eventually boomerang back on a lot of people i think we'll see some somalian starving somalian children uh, wearing 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 shirts (laughs) yeah um that is going to happen in the near future haitians yeah, mm-hmm. the Haitians. Believe it uh, or not, yeah, the horseman I think could be okay because it's it's an original idea from Chuck Dixon and uh, and the artist, as far as I know. So that might not be as tainted with Eric Eric July's idea. So I don't know. Maybe that could be good. We'll see. Um, yeah, we'll see about that. Um, hold on a second here. We do have another guest joining us uh, tonight. This will be fun, ladies and gentlemen. Dick Masterson. Uh, hello, hello, everyone. Hello. What's up? Uh, what you guys think of my response to the response? Well, uh, your response to the response? I didn't see that. What, yeah. We're watching uh, the video of you criticizing, in good faith, oh, the trailer yeah. to uh, Yaira right now. And it is a good faith criticism. I want to praise you for that. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I'm excited about the M. She Ripaverse. Um, <laughs> I'm excited to see what kind of uh, feminist superheroes... Uh, that are yoked to the gills come out of it. And uh, the women that can take it across the line. You know, this is a brave new world where uh, uh, women are in positions of, of power and directing and acting and in studios. And I'm excited to see where Eric takes it or lets them take it. You know, Well, we're going to see the rest of this. And then we're also going to watch your friends at Revenge of the Sis. I think you like those guys. You know those guys? I love them. Yes. Okay, well, they did a nice commentary for the making of of uh, of this video. Um, uh, once again, I just, uh, I, I agree with you. I'm excited about the future of Ripperverse in which, uh, you the know, rip herverse. Rip let's get herverse, it right. The rip herverse, uh, in which a man raises a lot of money to make comics and films, and then he <laughs> turns it over to, uh, lesbian, uh, incest, uh, pornographer twins. Yeah. 
leftist uh, activists like, take the ball yeah. from there. Yeah, uh, in, intersectional feminists. So uh, we're on. We're in good hands. We got a big future ahead of us. Let's wrap this up. Let's wrap up the uh, your commentary, Dick. If you'd like to add to it. Now, wait a second. Did um, when I, before I finish this, you said that you had a comment, a reaction to a reaction. What is this? Uh, well, this is my. I mean, I guess this is kind of my response to Eric's response to my response. This is like my criticism of his criticism of my criticism. Oh, uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, right. I remember he said, uh, just consider this a criticism of your criticism. I think it was dog shit and whatever it is. Uh, it's ridiculous. Uh, all right, here we go. Let's finish this up, and then we're going to watch Revenge of the Sis, and they'll take the ball from there. Penis. For the eye saw people. Who cares? Yaira, stand down. stand down. The same voice actor who sucks. So the thing everybody was running from was a lady who spent the entire short film on the ground looking completely useless she and vomits a laser for no reason. Why was she a threat to anyone? Did she do something? Usually a trailer makes me... Oh, he's doing that thing where he doesn't tell you fucking anything. And then you have to be like, oh, man, I got to so read the comic to, to find out why that lady vomited a laser and everybody was mad about it. Huh. Didn't even look at the laser hurt anybody. Of course, I love when trailers are followed by a minute and 30 seconds of credits. credits. Wow, man, this is like you're really taking yourself seriously. It's bizarre. Uh, whoa, my, what was that? How many vowels? Couldn't you also? OK, who did Andre Anthony play? The guy in the hat, the guy who ran by like. <laughs> Does everyone need a sit? Usually you save that in the movie for like the big One time page. actor. Yeah, the big like, stars. Top billing. Oh my mm. God. Tom Matt Cruise. Damon. It's like Monty Python. Affleck. It's like the Holy Grail yeah. credits. <laughs> you can just have one page with all the credits on it. Oh, Mackenzie Gray. Oh yeah, I loved when she ran by and went, Salai! And Marshall Vick. And Marshall Vick. Oh. All on the screen at once. How are you fucking serious? Yes. Carol Brown, assistant to Mr. July. The Carol chick on the ground is in Gen V, by the uh, way. We get to know. Oh, oh yeah, what's Gen V? Uh, the boy spinoff on who, Amazon who Prime. On so she was oh, yeah. an yeah. actual yeah. actress. Yeah. Uh, the only one with talent. Drivers, though, multiple drivers on the set. For <laughs> yeah, she was Very important. Uh, Poor black guy can't keep any of his money. Editor Steve Rosell, who is now. now I, I just want to pause this for a second because, you know, Eric July is implying that this thing costs, like, I don't know. 400 bucks to make like what is he saying what is his current code as like, much as a forklift or less than a forklift i think he said yeah that's what he said and, yeah. and people were doing price checks on forklifts i guess 15 grand ish they can go up to like 100 grand though too like they're all over the map so i have no idea what he spent so it's uh, all canadian subsidies like all those people the second crew to like uh record all those uh all those uh, employees gushing about what a great guy he is that was all mm. just paid for by the canadian government is that what he's saying there's no possible way uh, that the canadian government pitched anything in here he would have said that here's rip averse coat posts uh who was saying one day is not enough time to film the perfect trailer you guys are demanding i want to make something clear i didn't ask for shit. i'm not demanding anything from eric july uh, i didn't ask him to do this he did this to me. I, I, you know, this is the whole thing. Like, I, none of us are, none of us asked for this. We don't want I, him to make things like this. He's not good at it. And if he is going to make it, we're going to laugh at it. Listen, I, actually, you proved one day is good enough though to make the trailer, like the re-edit that you played. Yeah, that was, made that, that in thirty all seconds. All that footage was done in one day, and it had a shorter runtime. I mean, technically, it would have been cheaper in a way. Yeah, if you knew how to edit anything together so that it could be kind of cohesive, if you had any ideas about storytelling, if you had any notions about how to do, uh, you know, how to do something like this. If you have a story. If you, um, yeah. gosh, God, uh, yeah. listen, yeah. now you're asking too much, uh, know. you know, <laughs> and if you're looking for a story around here, uh, I don't know, what are you, a kindergartner? Uh, he's got to, he's got to like lay it out for you here. Uh, you have to follow along. Keep giving him 35 bucks plus shipping uh, for the next few years, and maybe you'll find out what ISOM even is, what yeah. he wants, uh, what his goals are. Uh, what it what is, are his powers, guys? Nobody well, knows what I his did learn he are. can't fly. I did that. In, I mean, well, that's... in the trailer and the comic, he says he, like, trained his body. So I guess <sighs> he works out. trained his body into, super, into, into being a superhero? Is that... Yeah, he, but he fell off of a skyscraper. How do you train to survive that? He's like the Scarlet Letter. Like he whips himself in the name of Jesus Christ. <laughs> to you know what? Up. Like you're you're one hundred percent right about that, though. <laughs> I know. <laughs> this is you know I, I'm starting to see what the story is here. Like what this actually is. Um, 
they're trying to resurrect Jesus Christ. That's what this whole thing is. Yeah. Isom's cross on his belt. Yaira is an angel. Uh, and, uh, you know, she might be trying to stop the resurrection of Jesus Christ, but that's what projects this is. This is, you know what? Like, I, I just want to, I want the uh, Christian ministry, uh, that sued him to just kind of take a second look at this because it's going to, it's really odd. You know, I think that the ISOM ministry's goal is to spread the word of Jesus Christ. It isn't to actually, uh, you know, reincarnate the Lord Jesus Christ using his DNA. Is it like... Because that is a confusing thing. Uh, this The whole thing about ISOM apparently is to create Jerusalem Park using like the DNA of, uh, you know, my, my theory is, uh, you know, when he was uh, clipped, Jesus was Jewish, you know, so of course he was clipped. Uh, his body was resurrected, but there would still be the foreskin out there uh, encased in amber. You take some of that DNA. Uh, Jurassic Park. Jerusalem Park. <laughs> Jurassic uh, Jerusalem Park. Yeah. You could see, you know, so I think that's what ISOM actually is. And um, it is a concern of mine, uh, you know, on behalf of the ministry, uh, that there be no confusion uh, about what the ministry's purpose is versus this comic book. Yeah, just seems valid. like that's, you know, could be a little bit of a problem. Well, it's weird that he hires white women to tell the story of the white superhero. But if, if there is going to be this entire religious discussion, discussion going on it it's also weird that the two white women he hired are former satanists that's weird uh, there's it? no former satanists about them they are oh they're operating Active. uh yeah they're they're doing exactly what satanists do i am a satanist so i can say absolutely they are conforming 100 percent to satanist values which is say whatever it takes to get mm. your foot in the door to get the to get the bag to secure the bag that's true isn't it yeah uh, and laugh at all of uh, Az's jokes. Yeah. Um, all right, hold on. Let's finish this up. Parasite's taking this guy. Wait, who did a, a Splinter Silk with the VFX? Fantastic. Texas team. This is just literally all every, Eric everyone who works in Eric's warehouse gets a credit. Oh, Video so comics. Video assist manager. Cash, Cash checks. Man. Purple Dog. Oh, good work, Purple Dog. Okay, so. The was shot on location in the generous support of the Surrey City Hall. A Surrey? Oh! Oh! Wait, what'd you say? You interrupted it with your fucking well, screaming. I didn't know that was Stop happening. screaming. <laughs> I never sat through the credits Stop before. screaming. <laughs> that lady yelled, Solari, I want to get in on the fun. I didn't. I never sat through the credits. Winter is here. Winter is here! This is like... Don't make superhero comics. It's like Especially don't make these ones. Like this, this is She-Hulk, uh, man. Yeah. What are you guys supporting? Well, I want to see her penis flop mm -hmm. out, which after yeah. strikes a pose. I like that she is wearing like a necktie where her cock <laughs> would be. That's no, it is literally, is literally a cock. Have, it's a cock. That's what that is. A it's a penis. It's so it's a obvious, silhouette. man. <sighs> By the way, we have 2,545 people watching now that Dick Masterson's here. Uh, can I get a countdown on what uh, Yellow Flash has uh, <clears> on his uh, formerly big uh, Saturday Night Show? Uh, we took that from you, Yellow Flash. We took your uh, show 2,200. We took your show from you. You used to have 3,600 people, and then you dared to fuck with me. And now uh, we have your show. We took your show. Uh, and we He's salty, to... man. Going after housewives and just, like, being a reply guy for everything having to do with you and Eric. That's, that's it. Jealousy. Uh, desperation is a stinky cologne. The Negra, and I need you to subscribe to, um, uh, it says here, Clips! Oh!